What are we making today on Cooking with Trevo? The perfect, perfect mashed potato. And you're gonna see why I'm showing you how to make this amazing mashed potato. Come on over here and let's see what we got going on. This is very, very simple. You don't need me to show you boiling potatoes, but there you are just in case, guys, all right? So 20, 25 minutes, good flowery potato. I'm using roosters. When they're done, take them off. And what we do is let them steam dry. So they are just perfect. They are already done, flowery. And here on our stove, we've got cream and butter melting very, very gently. And that's what we're gonna put into our mashed potato. Now, you guys know me and I tell you all the time, do not use stupid gadgets, okay? But unfortunately, for the perfect mash, we are gonna use the gadgets. So here's what we do. Look, just tip those potatoes into a bowl. Okay, and this is what's known as a potato ricer, or as Tones calls it, a huge garlic crusher. Why don't you use the bag of your knife, he said to me. I reckon I could fit something of Tones in there. Anyway, so here's what we do, right? Put one or two of the spuds in, close it over, and then just mash it, or mince it, or rice it straight down. Watch this. And that is the difference. Okay, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to do that to all these potatoes now. Give me two seconds and we'll come right back. So that's all our potatoes minced. And now what we're going to do is we're going to get a little bit of cream and butter from the stove. I'll bring that over, Tones. Look at that. Simple. Okay? Now, we're going to add this in and if you find that it's needs a little bit more cream or even a little bit more milk tones, there's no problems. You're just gonna add it in. You just gotta play around with it for a little while. And you're saying, Trevor, why are you showing me how to make mashed potato? Well, if you're following the whole videos that we're making on bolognese, we've got a great one on cottage pie, right? Click on this pot here, right, for the link to show you how to make the cottage pie. Trust me, guys, this is just part of it. So, here we go. Look at that, beautiful. Now, tones, we're gonna pour this in here. I just, you know what, everything, like, is so bad about this, it's just so good. Cream, butter, spuds. The Irish make the best mashed potato in the world. And what we're gonna do is, in, is just stir that in, and you can see, not a lump inside. Now, some people might think that that's fine, but I want a little bit more, but I also want to season it as well, okay? So good grind of the pepper mill. And also, spuds love salt, so do I. Rock salt, you know me by now, lads. It's all I ever use in cooking. And there's a thousand things you can add to mashed potato, but I love to show you the basic mashed potato. So then when we're doing other videos to show you how to make horseradish potato, Dijon potato, champ potato, bacon and leek mashed potato, it's only gonna take me two seconds. So I'm gonna pour in the rest of this now. And I'm gonna give you the greatest tip ever for your dinner parties. You can have all this done in advance. All of it. Four or five minutes in the microwave. Look at this, sounds it's just getting better and better. Four or five minutes in the microwave, into the oven, in one of these amazing dishes, Le Creuset, or an oven-proof dish. A little bit of butter on top and oh my god we're talking heaven look at that look at this tea towel quickly one crack of the peppermint one little bit of salt a little bit of parsley and that, my friends, is how to make perfect mashed potato every time. Like it, comment on it, share it, guys. Let us know if you want us to cook anything. Let us know if you want us to do something special. You tell us. Me and Tones are going to do it. Or Tones and I, as my English teacher used to say. Mashed potato, trade style.